Tyler here with Live Hunt. Now, uh, yesterday we got put on this lake behind me here on uh, Kodiak Island. Um, kind of got lucky. The weather's been terrible down here as usual. And uh, got a nice window to get us put in. Got our base camp set up. Now, uh, last night we had just a torrential downpour all night long. Probably rained, you know, three or four inches. And, uh, had to relocate some of our camp stuff to keep it out of the water, but uh, we're all right. Now this morning we spotted two billies up on this Razorback Ridge about a mile and a half away in pretty good stockable position, uh, but we were preoccupied with getting our getting our camp and some of our stuff dried out because uh, it would be a, probably a two-day trip over there getting the goat and back. But we're going to give her a try tomorrow if the weather holds. Hey, well it's uh, our uh, third day in here and we, we packed up here and made a spike camp. We got this one goat that we were watching yesterday bedded down up here so we're going to try and kill him. And then there was another one we saw, pretty good looking Billy up here behind us. I think he fed over the ridge so uh, we're going to go check to see what see if we can find him and uh, hopefully we'll have two goats shortly. Now I see a cellar wall Far from the sun, still afraid to fall A fearful distance Like stop by the light from electric resistance I have not yet been home tonight Now I see horizons call The difference in degrees makes us nothing to it all Steve shot his goat last night and uh, we got it all cut up up on the hill and this morning we spotted this goat uh, up above our camp and you know we kind of had a weather's been real crappy so you know with a break in the weather we figured we better take the opportunity it came up and shot this goat it uh, looks like a five-year-old nanny which is not you know not a baby for sure um, got pretty nice horns on her and a good looking hide despite the, the blood she got kind of took a tumble so that's standard goat hunting for you but yeah, I mean, it's just a real beautiful up here, very steep. Um, you know, we're kind of on the not steep side. The back side of this ridge is just Im completely impassable. And that's why there's so many goats here. But uh, yeah, it's my first mountain goat and I'm happy, happy with her. And uh, now it's time for all the work to begin. I will not try to blunder. You shall not have to walk alone. Either confused, I wonder. I will never know if you do not believe I'm learning. How